and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I will be sharing with you guys 20 plus Christmas gift ideas on a budget. This is for all my people that like to save that money. So without further ado, let's get on with this video. As you can see, I've moved to the side so that you guys can see the Christmas gift ideas pop up right here. The first one I have is a new comforter, and I know some of you guys are probably thinking, aren't those kind of expensive? Actually, it depends on where you get them from. You can get cheaper comforters at Walmart and Ross, even online, maybe Amazon. Just make sure it's still good quality and it's a style that you like. You can also get some nice pillows to go with that. Speaking of bed accessories, I have another gift idea. And a good Christmas gift idea on a budget is a throw blanket. This way you can keep warm and also keep your bed looking stylish. You can get these from Walmart, online. I'm sure Target has some. Almost anywhere. <laughs> Next up we have hair accessories. You guys probably see me all the time wearing hair accessories like hair clips, butterfly clips, and I wear them because I feel like it spices up your hairstyle a little bit. You can find berets, butterfly clips, hair clips, rubber bands, and all that stuff at the store or online. Amazon actually has bundles of hair clips for cheap. I think I actually got a pack of 300 butterfly clips for only $12. So if you're into doing your hair and spicing it up, definitely look into hair accessories. Next on the list, I have a new phone. And yes, I know phones can be really expensive. But once again, it depends on the brand and type of phone that you get. We all know that iPhones and Apple products can be up there in price. So maybe switch to something like Samsung or an LG. I know, I know some people are like, oh, iPhone is the best. But does it really matter at the end of the day? As long as you have a phone that you can use and that you like, that's all that matters. Speaking of phones, you can actually start a business with it and work on your business with your new phone. If all goes well with that business, you won't have to be on a budget anymore. The next Christmas gift idea is candles. You can get candles from Walmart, any local grocery store, I'm pretty sure. Bath and Body Works. All the candles I've seen are relatively cheap. And this is a good Christmas gift because now that the weather is changing and becoming colder, a lot of people are closing their windows and turning up that heat, which can make all the bad fumes and smell just stay in your house. So adding a fresh candle can bring a nice scent to your house. Up next we have lip balm and lip gloss. We all know that those are pretty cheap. And we also all know about that beauty store lip gloss that everyone gets for about a dollar. So you can have cute and glossy lips. For super duper cheap, they have a bunch of different types as well. This keeps your lips moisturized and looking good for pictures. For lip balm, I definitely recommend Carmex. I think it works the best. Next, we have scrunchies. I've already mentioned how Amazon has a bunch of hair accessories that you can get in bundles for cheap. And scrunchies are one of them. Let me see, actually. I see a pack of 60 scrunchies for only $13.99. Whoa, this one says 65 hair scrunchies for only $12? What, 75 for $10? These are just getting better and better. So if you're into scrunchies and you wanna collect them or you just wanna add them to your outfits, definitely look on Amazon. I think they have really nice deals. You can also find them at Walmart in the hair section and also at a beauty store. Next on the list we have clothes. You guys can find cute clothes on a budget. It depends on where you shop, especially online. You can shop at Shein, Zawful, Forever 21. They all have nice clothes for cheap, not sponsored by the way. Just make sure you check the reviews first so that you don't get an outfit that looks nothing like the picture. The reviews definitely help out. Okay, I feel like this one is a little obvious, but at the same time, nobody thinks of it. Candy. You can literally get candy from the Dollar Tree for only a dollar. This would be a good gift for people who have a sweet tooth. I know I wouldn't mind getting candy as a gift. You can even create a little DIY snack basket where you add all of their favorite snacks and candies in it. That'd be really sweet. This next gift is always a good gift idea. I put money in all of my gift idea videos because sometimes you don't know what you wanna get. So if you ask them for some money, you have the freedom to buy your own gift. Or you can save it, which is also a good idea. Next, I have some stylish and cheap shoes. Some examples are Vans, Converse, and Champion shoes. Instead of getting super expensive and bougie shoes like Louis Vuitton or Gucci, you can get nice casual shoes that everyone still wears, and they are definitely still in style. I have some pairs of Vans myself, and also Converse. Ooh, this is a good one. I feel like a lot of people still want this gift. LED lights. TikTok has mainly been the one promoting these LED lights because 
almost every TikToker has them. Believe me, I have them as well. They're actually not that expensive either. You can get them off of Amazon and I think I've even seen them at Walmart. They're really nice and can spice up your room. If you're a little bit bored of what your room looks like, definitely get some LED lights if you'd like to. It can also make your TikToks a little more interesting as well. Another good one, this is one that probably people don't want, but I think it's something that people need. A planner. It doesn't even have to specifically be a planner. It could be a notebook or a binder. I have my own right here. Planners and notebooks are very good if you wanna work on scheduling your time, whether it has to do with school or business. I use this binder to write down my video ideas and right now I'm using it for my Christmas gift ideas I'm sharing with you guys. It definitely helps with being more organized and put together, I should say. So even though not a whole bunch of people would want this, it can be something that you can ask for if you feel like you're all over the place and you just need to start planning things out. Believe me, I've been there. Now for my people who like makeup. You can get drugstore makeup that's still good quality or makeup dupes. When I say makeup dupes, I mean makeup products that look like more expensive makeup brands. So you can find an eyeshadow palette that looks like a MAC eyeshadow palette or a lipstick that looks like a Kylie lipstick, but for a cheaper price. And for drugstore makeup, you can get cheap, good quality makeup from the brands e.l.f., Wet n Wild, L'Oreal, so on and so forth. Now for the people who aren't really into that stuff, books. If you're bored and have nothing to do, plus you enjoy reading, why not ask for some books? Or you can give someone who you know likes to read some books this Christmas. One book I do recommend is the Bible. I basically explained in my last Christmas gift ideas video why I think this is important and a great Christmas gift to give. All right, here's the thing. I feel like when you're on a budget, it's better to get things that you need rather than want. So one of those gifts are school supplies. We've been in school for a pretty good amount of time now, and I know some of us are running out of school supplies. Like for me, I'm running out of mechanical pencils. So let's get a school supply refresh. You can ask for some school supplies if you need it. New pencils, erasers, paper. If you have to print a lot of stuff out, you can ask for an ink cartridge or give this to someone that you know needs it. This is a good one, jewelry, but cheap jewelry that still looks good. I'm sure you can find cheap jewelry at Claire's, don't forget about Claire's, Ross, and Walmart. I think they have a specific section for jewelry at Walmart as well. This next one is like an alternative Christmas gift. You can get a cheap water bottle. I know a lot of people love hydro flasks and flasks in general, but if you still want a water bottle but for cheaper, definitely go for a plastic one. You can get them online, at Walmart, at a grocery store, almost anywhere. And when I say plastic water bottles, I mean reusable plastic water bottles. Not the ones you just drink out of, you might refill it, drink out of it again, and then just throw away. I have a reusable water bottle here and let me tell you, it's really nice to have water at your side all the time. So definitely look into a reusable water bottle. Masks, we all know how important masks are. They keep you safe and from getting sick. And it also protects others that you come in contact with. You don't even have to buy a mask, you can DIY one at home. You can grab an old shirt, sweatshirt, pants, leggings. And search ways how you can make it into a mask. You can fold it, cut it, do anything. Just make sure it's comfortable to wear and that you can still breathe. And if you wanna gift it to someone, make sure it looks good, smells good, and is clean. Next, we have gift cards. How can you go wrong with gift cards? It's basically money in a cute little card. You can get gift cards for fast food places like McDonald's, Starbucks or stores like Macy's, Sears, Forever 21, and all the other places you wanna shop at. This is also a great gift to give to others if you don't know what they want, but you know what kind of stores they like to shop at. And the last Christmas gift idea on a budget is re-gifting. I'm pretty sure a lot of people re-gift during the holidays. If they've ever gotten a gift that they don't really want or just can't find a way to use, they can give that gift to somebody else, especially if it's still brand new. If you have an old candle sitting somewhere, even clothes you've bought but never worn before, you can make it look nice, wrap it up, and give it to someone else. Just make sure it's not the person who gave it to you though. And also make sure they don't know that it's being re-gifted. Just re-gift things that you know still look nice, fresh, still work, and that you don't need but someone else can use. 
So that's basically it for my Christmas gift ideas on a budget. All right, that's basically all I have for these 20 Christmas gift ideas on a budget. Hopefully this helped you out in some way and gave you some ideas that you can use. By the way, I have a little message about how I feel about Christmas and I'll just show that clip to you right now. To me, Christmas shouldn't be all about receiving and getting gifts. It's mainly about Jesus Christ's birthday and giving to others because that's what Jesus did. He loves and cares about all of us and is always giving. So if you can, definitely give a gift to someone you love. You can even give gifts to strangers that you don't know. That's what Christmas is all about. It can be something as simple as a drawing or something extreme like a house. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that little message. And also please make sure to check out my other video that I did where I showed you 20 bougie Christmas gift ideas for 2020. And that's all I have for you guys today. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, Fix. It was all night, and it came to the world, but the world was all night.